December 1st, 1955 is a day that has gone down in history. A Montgomery woman chose to not give up her bus seat and in return was arrested. Because of that moment, uh, that sparked a movement, uh, a bus boycott that lasted 382 days here in Montgomery. And so we are commemorating this day. That woman was none other than Alabama's very own Mrs. Rosa Parks. She stand up from the crowd and say something. I'm not going to be like everyone. I'm going to be different. And she's different and I love that. And the Alabama legislature is now officially recognizing that historic day statewide. December 1st will be the very first officially recognized Rosa Parks Day. And as you can see, the Rosa Parks Museum is doing plenty to prepare for the big day. We have been hustling and bustling with uh, getting things uh, cleaned and prepared and we're looking forward to accommodating large crowds that day and uh, we're excited about that. And the big crowds will be a result of the many events the museum has going on. From extended hours and complimentary admission to theatrical performances, speeches and even a program with Mrs. Rosa Parks' church. I just think young people are supposed to came here because it can create something special in the hearts. It's a day for everyone. Uh, all citizens should come out and enjoy the events. For more information on Rosa Parks Day or the Rosa Parks Museum, you can visit them on their website at troy.edu slash Rosa Parks. In Montgomery, Lauren Harkson, Troy, Trojan Vision News.